Quantum tornado for studying black holes. Using superfluid helium, scientists have created quantum vortices in the laboratory that resemble black holes in their behavior. These types of experiments could provide a better understanding of how black holes interact with their surroundings. Helium cooled to just a few degrees above absolute zero becomes superfluid. In this state, the behavior of matter is determined by quantum phenomena. Viscosity, i.e. internal friction, disappears in the liquid, so it does not lose kinetic energy during movement. Matter in this state set in motion in a closed cycle can circulate indefinitely without any additional energy input. Research conducted by scientists from the University of Nottingham. In cooperation with researchers from King's College London and Newcastle University, allowed the creation of an innovative experimental platform for studying black holes. The vortex generated in superfluid helium mimics the environment of these objects with such great precision that it provides unprecedented insight into how they interact with their surroundings. The results and description of the research were published in the journal Nature. Using superfluid helium allowed us to study tiny surface waves in greater detail and accuracy than our previous experiments involving water. The viscosity of superfluid helium is extremely low. And therefore we were able to study the interaction of waves with a superfluid tornado in detail and compare the results with our theoretical predictions said Patrick Svankara from the University of Nottingham, lead author of the paper. The work began with the construction of a special cooling system that could hold several liters of superfluid helium. Scientists cooled helium to minus 271 degrees Celsius. At this temperature, liquid helium acquires extraordinary quantum properties. These properties typically hinder the formation of vortices in other superfluid substances, but in the case of helium they can be stabilized. As Svankara admitted, Superfluid helium contains tiny objects called quantum vortices that tend to move away from each other. In our system, we managed to confine tens of thousands of these quanta in a compact object resembling a small tornado, achieving record-breaking spin flow in the quantum liquid, explained the researcher. Black holes do not emit or reflect light. These objects are so massive that after reaching a certain point, event horizon, the escape velocity, i.e. the speed needed to leave the object's gravitational field, exceeds the speed of light in a vacuum and even light is unable to leave this area. Therefore, black holes cannot be directly observed and, therefore, cannot be studied effectively. Scientists are able to locate them based on interactions with the surrounding matter and light. Looking at their vortices, scientists noticed intriguing similarities between their quantum motion and the gravitational impact of spinning black holes on the surrounding space-time. This opens up new possibilities for simulating black holes and studying their interactions with their surroundings. When we first observed clear signatures of black hole physics in our experiment in 2017, it was a breakthrough moment for understanding some bizarre phenomena that are often difficult, if not impossible, to study otherwise, 
said Professor Silke Weinfurtner, co-author of the paper. Now, with our sophisticated experiment, we have taken this research to the next level, which could ultimately lead us to understand how quantum fields behave in curved space-time around astrophysical black holes, he added.